how to solve square root 3 plus 2i so first of all I can select square root 3 plus 2i is equal to x plus i y it is our first equation then I can say square root 3 plus 2i is equal to x plus i y I use both side whole square then I can say here is square root is cancelled so we are find out 3 plus 2i is equal to you know that a plus b whole square square plus 2ab plus b square according to these rules I can say here is x square plus 2ab plus b square then I can say this equation becomes 3 plus 2i is equal to x square and i square it will be minus 1 and here is y square and it will be 2xy i now if I compare the real part and imaginary part this time I can say here is x square minus y square is equal to 3 and 2xy is equal to 2 so it is our uh, second equation and this is our third equation then we know that x square minus y square is equal to 3 now we are find out x square plus y square is equal to what because of that we are need what is the value of x and y now we know that x square plus y square whole square is equal to x square minus y square whole square plus 4av then I can say this equation becomes x square minus y square whole square plus 2xy whole square because of that 2 squared will be 4 and here is x square and this is y square then we know that x square minus y square is, is equal to 3 so 3 square plus 2xy it will be 2 2 square then it will be 9 plus 4 and we will find out the value of x square plus y square is equal to 13 9 plus 4 it will be 13 whole square is equal to 13 then I use both sides square root then I can say square root is cancel so we are find out here is x square plus y square is equal to square root 13 then it is our fourth equation and our second equation is x square minus y square is equal to 3 so I can say x square minus y square is equal to 3 then equation 4 plus equation 2 I can say easily x square plus x square it will be 2x square and here is y square and this is minus y square so it is 0 and here is square root 13 plus 3 then if I divide both side 2 then I can say here is x square is equal to square root 13 plus 3 over 2 then if I use both side again square root this time I can say here is x is equal to 1 plus minus 1 over square root 2 and it will be square root down square root 13 plus 3 now we are find out the value of y so again equation 4 minus equation 2 uh, this time I can say here is x square x square is 0 because of that we are subtract both equation and y square minus y square and it will this minus it will be plus so I can say 2 y square is equal to square root 13 minus 3 then I divide both side 2 2 to cancel so it will be y square is equal to square root 13 minus 3 over 2 then again I use both sides square root so I can say here is y is equal to plus minus 1 over square root 2 times square root down square root 13 minus 3 now I put on the value of x and y first equation our first equation is square root 3 plus 2y is equal to x plus i y so I can say square root 3 plus 2i is equal to x plus i y so we'll find out here is x is 
plus minus 1 over square root 2 then I can say plus minus 1 over square root 2 square root down square root 13 plus 3 and this plus and this i and we we'll find out the value of y is plus minus 1 over square root 2 then square root down square root 13 minus 3 then I can say here is plus minus 1 over square root 2 is common so it will be square root 13 plus 3 bracket power is half because of that this square root plus and here is plus minus 1 over square root 2 is common so I can say it will be square root 13 minus 3 bracket power is half and this i so this is our final answer thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel goodbye